Hi, my name is John Ball. I'm an application engineer at Xair. In this video, I'm going to show how to repair and refurbish an eighth inch no drip atomizing nozzle. The model RBK90 is a kit that would include a spring, an X ring, and five other O rings. For the external mix, you will be needing all of the O rings. For the internal mix, the one small o-ring is not required. I'll be using an AF9010SS, an internal mix atomizing nozzle, for my demonstration. Remove the air and liquid cap. You will expose the valve stem. Remove the small o-ring from the liquid cap. Remove the tiny o-ring from the stem. Turn the atomizing nozzle around to work on the no-drip cylinder. With the pin wrench, remove the cylinder tube from the atomizing body. If you look in the body, there will be uh, an O-ring inside, as well as the bottom of the cylinder. Use an O-ring pick to remove these O-rings. Push the pin upward until the piston comes out. The X-ring is located on the piston in a groove. Remove it. Inspect the parts and make sure that there is no debris. Clean with mild detergent if needed. To reassemble, we will start by placing a new X-ring onto the piston. Align the stem with the hole and with your finger run the piston all the way in. With the new o-ring, place this in the groove, place the new o-ring in the body, place the new spring inside the cap, thread it into the cylinder. Tighten lightly. Replace the O-ring on the liquid cap. With the smaller O-ring, this may be tricky, but if you add a bit of grease to your finger, this will help. Add the new tiny O-ring over the stem and press. Thread the liquid and air cap back onto the body, tighten until snug. For the external mix atomizing nozzle, the extra O-ring will go on to the assembly. If you have any questions, you can give us a call at 1-800-903-9247. Thanks for watching.